Hi everyone, this is David from Benchmark. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to stake a point using Microsurvey Field Genius 10. I have a S321 Plus Rover here from Hemisphere and a Juniper Systems Mesa 2 Rugged Tablet to do my staking on. So down on my screen you can see I already have a fix, so I'm just going to click on Standard Measure and that's going to bring up my different measurement modes. I'm going to switch it to Staking and then Stake Points. Now I can choose which point I want to stake. I already have a few points in this job. So I'm just going to go ahead and choose point number four, and then I'm going to click on stake point. Now that's going to bring up my viewing cardinal direction screen, and that's going to give me a direction north-south, a distance east-west, and an elevation distance to get to my point. So I'm just going to follow those numbers. As I'm getting closer, you can see those numbers changing here. Once I'm right on top of the point, I'm within the tolerance I have set, all those X's are going to turn into check marks meaning I'm within tolerance for the shot. I then click on RTK Fix to take the stake shot, hit Store Position, and I'm going to click on Save Point and Raw Data. Now I can rename this shot to 4-stake or whatever I want, but if I just click on Store Point before selected, it's going to tell me it already exists, do I want to store 5? So I'm going to say go ahead. Once that's done, it's going to ask me what the next point I want to stake is. I'm done for now, so I'm just going to hit Close. And if I click on my points here, you can see I now have that fifth shot, which is my stake of point number four. That's all for today's video. If you have any questions, feel free to give us a call at 1-888-286-3204 or visit our website at www.bench-mark.ca. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.